Hello everyone, how are you? It's Saturday here in Melbourne, Australia and I've got the most exciting unboxing. Well, they're all exciting to me, but this mm. one in particular is super exciting because yes, people, I'm gonna say it, I'm popping my cherry. I am indeed. I am going to be diving into for the very first time Dreamer Designs. Yes, yes sir, yes ma'am. So I have four paintings that have arrived and I'm super excited to see what Dreamer Designs is all about. What are their canvases like? What are their diamonds like? What are their um, uh, paintings like? What is the everything like? <laughs> with the, with, 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 Gracie, calm down, calm your farm, calm down. What's <laughs> up? This is your first time stumbling across my channel. Please don't be scared. <laughs> um, if you have stumbled, I would love for you to subscribe and that is by hitting the little subscribe button down there and staying around on the channel, okay? And with that being said, if you are coming back, hey, thumbs up and welcome back to you. I don't wanna waste any more time. The only last thing to mention is that if you are yet to tell me where you are watching from in your part of the world and you'd like to be a part of my world, but don't forget to hit me up in the comments down below and let me know where you're watching from. Let's not waste any more time. Let's turn this camera around, get you onto my table and dive into these boxes. Come on guys, come with me. Come, come. Okay guys, are you ready to jump into this box? This box that has come to me from Dreamer Designs. I've got my handy dandy Sandra knife here, sent to me by the lovely Sandra West. Uh, just to give you some particulars, I did order this with a 30% off code. Okay, you can only use these codes once, I believe. So that's my code gone, but I'm pretty sure that I did uh, use that code there. And it was ordered on June 13 and it got to me on Wednesday, June 30th. Okay, which is from America to Australia. Shall we get into it? Let's get into it, I'm excited. I wonder how many of you have guessed what paintings I have ordered. I wonder how many of you have. <laughs> now, this is going to be a, a very in-depth, I might leave that open because I may need it, an in-depth view of these paintings, purely because this is my first time with Dreamer Designs. So... I have seen others, of course, unbox Dreamer Designs. I've not seen anyone unbox these particular ones, okay? So we do have four. I'm going to pop them out here. Take them all out one at a time. Oh, my goodness, I'm so excited. I am so excited. I'm also happy to say that <clears throat> up until the timing and video... Oh, look at that shadow. Oh, Hello. Can I do rabbit ears? No, yeah, there they are. <laughs> Let me see if I can close those curtains and we still get some good light. And I'll keep talking. Uh, up until the video, up until this video is recorded, Dreamer Designs is still offering uh, free shipping to Australia uh, when you hit over X amount of dollars spent, okay? So, uh, hence why one of the reasons that I decided to order. Aside from that, there are these paintings that I really, really wanted to have a look at. So, let's have a look at the box. New to me box. We've got Dreamer Designs. I know you guys have seen these before, or you, maybe you have, maybe you haven't. Dreamer Designs DIY Art Premium Diamond Canvas. Their logo. They've got the ever famous handle that I hear so much about here, which is under the plastic. We've got our basic instructions here, okay, with uh, words and photos, what you get in your kit, okay, and then the features. So sparkling diamonds with AB accents, it's legally licensed, okay, full drill diamond fill canvas, dream of cloud canvas, lifetime warranty plus, uh-oh, insurance, okay. Now, I'm um, pick these up randomly, uh, as in, when I say pick them up randomly, I haven't uh, chosen them to present to you in any specific order, okay? So let's just crack into them. There's gonna be a whole pile of rubbish on the corner. <laughs> I don't wanna bust a nail, so we're gonna use our knife to get it all out. Okay, cool, cool, cool. 
I've seen so many people unbox streamer designs and now it's my turn and I figure you know what strap yourselves in guys strap yourselves in ah, let me strap myself out <laughs> because we're going to be doing all of them all of them all right pop that box aside uh, this canvasy sort of uh, now I know what everyone bangs on about these little tabs look at that <laughs> I get my own tabs now. <laughs> uh, you get a drawstring bag, okay? Oh, and this is the box again, uh, when I was talking about the handle. So you can uh, take that wherever you wanna go, wherever you need to go, and transport it accordingly. So it comes with a drawstring bag. We've got our canvas here. We've got our toolkit. I don't even recall, I do not, and I need to sneeze, so forgive me in advance if I do. Um, here it comes, no it went. <laughs> oh my goodness, Dreamer Designs, it's branded as well. Okay, so I can pop that aside, a little dust cover as well. What I wanna do is, oh, and a little purple ribbon here. Imagine being the person who goes around and has to tie up all the, um, all the, these things, all the canvases with their ribbons. What I wanna do is take this out and let it start relaxing. Oh la la. You start relaxing there. And you can start relaxing there. Just, 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 just chills for a little bit. So this is a, what did we get here? Okay, we got a square. Like I said, I'd forgotten. I don't know what's square, what's round. So a square diamond painting here. They're our diamonds. And if you know me, you know that these are pretty much my color palettes. We have, ooh la la. A foam roller. <laughs> it comes rolled on a foam roller. Do with this what you please, okay? Mm -mm -mm. You can be happy, you can be sad, you can be not. You know, you just don't care. But you have a foam roller. Let's pop that aside. Instructions, instructions. Okay, again, uh, if you're a first time to diamond painting, it comes with full instructions here, pictorial and with words. Okay, it's got all their social media deets. Great idea to include these one, if you're new to diamond painting, but two, if you're giving this as a gift to someone, you can say, the instructions are included, knock yourself out, and oh, by the way, go check out Grey, Diamond Paint with Grace, her videos. She'll show you how to do it. <laughs> Shameless plug. <laughs> All right, what's this now? Oh, yes, of course. We have, let's roll it back. That didn't work well, but we have a sticker sheet. Wow, this is nice and big. This is real, oh, yeah, no, don't look at that. <laughs> this is really nice and big, this sticker sheet. So this is gonna be super, super handy. And what have we got here? Oh, what's, what's happened here? Oh, that cut off. Oh dear. So that's been cut, see how that's cut? Someone went a bit happy-go-lucky with a guillotine right there. So. Uh, we'll have to just make sure that these uh, don't have numbers that are cut off. Okay, uh, 49 colours apparently on this one. All right, have you relaxed? Have you relaxed, child? Let me just, um, oh, let's pop the ribbon aside. I'm, I'm excited. This, 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 is, it's not my normal self. Can you tell? Because like, it's my first dream of design. So uh this is kind of feels a bit like uh to be honest like diamond dots if i have to be honest feels a lot like diamond dots it's scalloped and surged at the edges as well so that's really nice okay <clears throat> oh my gosh the big reveal the big reveal can i get you all in shot uh let me see if i can pop the camera up just a little bit one sec i believe i've got you positioned in a little bit better of a an angle and things so that I can get it all in for you. All right, let's not waste any more time. Are you ready? Uno, due, e tre. 
and it's upside down. No, no. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. One sec, guys. I forgot my trusty dusty little uh, scraper thing to help flatten her out. So this is Entrata al Borgo. Okay, entrance to the Borgo. And a Borgo, borgo is traditionally a um, small uh, Italian villages in the medieval or Renaissance era. Okay, and Entrata, which is Entrata here, it's legally licensed artwork. It is by Guido Borelli. Okay, Guido Borelli. It is an 80 by 60. Okay, Entrata means entrance. Okay, so let's just, oh, this, oh, wow. Oh, gosh, sticky. I'm, I'm getting to feel all the good things, all the fun stuff all at once. <laughs> so let me just get this out. Uh, laying a little bit more flatterer for us all oh, for us all okay <gasps> wow wow I'm even though you're looking at it up there I'm still looking at it down here and I've got to say I've got to say I'm happy okay Yes, it's very reminiscent of a uh, Diamond Dots canvas. I'm just trying to get that to go flat. All right, let's 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 take a journey around. We've got a legend on this side. We've got a legend on this side. She comes with 49 colours. Gosh, that is so nice and big. Wow, I like that. That is huge. I mean, like as in, you know, you won't be straining your eyes. And it comes with, ooh la la three ABs and this is how Dreamer Designs denotes the ABs obviously I would suggest that it's uh, with an AB AB at the front so I'm guessing that they're our ABs and we're going to go in get into this and have a look at where they go uh, but as you can imagine and those of you that are new to my channel if you don't know I have Italian background my parents were born in Italy and they migrated out to Australia with their parents back uh, many, many, many years ago. I was born here in Australia, but I have never been to Italy. And that being said, I've had many conversations with my grandmother who is 96, about to be 97. And she often tells me uh, what it was like living there. And this, this sort of area is literally the sort of villages that she grew up in. I love this. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So we've got, you know, the bushes here. We've got bushes here. We've got the beautiful orange terracotta sort of walls happening here. It looks pixelated to the eye. I'm not going to lie. But through what you're looking at, it actually does look okay. I'm going to, I don't know if it's going to fit. But I'll put it here, what the actual original image looks like so that you can get an idea of, uh, of what the original painting looks like. I love these sorts of paintings. I love, love, love. Uh, we've got the doors here. It's just very simple yet detailed at the same time. And the, you get that sense that it is a cobblestone pathway through entrata which is the entrance okay so it's the entrance to the borgo through here and which will lead you down into the rest of the village there oh my gosh oh my gosh oh i didn't even do the toolkit that's how excited i was oh okay let me go through the toolkit because i haven't had a dream with the science toolkit i just did things all opposite all opposite all opposite oh well doesn't matter doesn't matter now, I, again, having heard so many talk about the plushness that is this, let me, oh, it's soft. <laughs> I don't know how much of what you saw, but it's soft. It's like, it's like very soft. I don't want to do it too much because my foundation will come off. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, it's like, but it is a beautiful soft pouch. Uh, this would be great, you know, if you once you're finished here, you can throw this in your bag, boom, in your handbag, purse, 
you know, put your spare, I don't know, whatever it might be that you need, uh, makeup, uh, uh, female hygienic uh, products. Let's go with that. No one would ever bust into that knowing what it was inside, right? True? I don't know. I'm just talking randomly here. <laughs> we have two purple squishies. We've got a bunch of baggies to keep us out of trouble. We have two boats with canvases, uh, with canvases, with uh, spouts, okay. Perfect, we've got two, and I love these caddies. I love I love waxing a caddy. You know what, I love me a caddy. And these are, uh, have got the Dreamer Designs logo on them. What have we got here? We've got some straighteners happening here. Whatever number that is, I probably won't be using it because it is a thicker one. There is a straightener though, which is nice and handy. And then another one, which is a, probably a three-placer as your multi-placers. We have tweezers, which are the sharp ones. So be mindful, keep the sheath and the cover on for your protection always. And we have two pens, your normal single placer pen. Okay, and this, and this one here, as it's been told to me, is got a tip on it, which is really good for ABs or special diamonds. So I'll be really interested to try this out, this baby out, because I don't have anything like that, and see what that's all like. Sorry about doing that all backwards, but you know how we roll in the land of Gracie. We might do things just ad hoc and all over the place. I, uh, that's how excited I was. I forgot to show you the toolkit. If you're new to diamond painting, honestly, guys, this is all you need to start. Now, Dreamer Designs does have a reward program. So, you know, the more that you purchase along the way, you end up going, in, you know, you're in different levels and they, gi and they give you rewards back, whether that be in the way of free shipping or uh, coupons or credits towards paintings, whatever the case may be. All right. Wow. Entrata al borgo. Grazie tanto, Guido, which means in Italian, it means thank you so much, Guido. Uh, our diamonds come packaged. It's got the name of the painting on here. So it says two of two. I'm assuming here it'll have two of one. Yes, it does. Let's have a look. I want to see very quickly what the ABs are, if nothing else. Being that it, you know, oh my gosh. How many did I say? Three. That's not a bad crack of the whip on the first shot for a dream of designs to have three ABs. All right. Oh la la. And oh, that's almost, they're almost like neon 80s oranges. Look at that. Okay, so the, the packages, these always remind me of blowflies when I see them being videotaped. That always throws me. I wish they would really take those off because they are quite distracting. For me, anyway. I'm not going to go through all the colours, but on the back, uh, 972239. I'm trying to see how they are in order if they are in order so where's the numbers here oh my gosh gracie so 832842 so i think these are in dmc order from what i can tell okay so they are in dmc order now let's oh i love 814 i don't know why but it is i think probably one of my favorite dmc not not, not my favorite color in the world but it is just such a luxurious color to be using. Oh, look at that glare. Oh, it's just not happening in the world of Gracie today. Um, all right, so let's, uh, let's, let's keep going, let's keep going because we've got a lot to get through, peeps. We've got a lot to get through. I'm on the hunt for the, I'm on the hunt for the, and looking at these, they look so shiny. So, so shiny. So shiny. Oh my goodness. Can you try to remove that glare? Not a lot of that. Look, just a little itty bitty peep, bit of that pink, but they are almost perfect looking. No jaggedy bits, no manky bits. All right, so no ABs in here. That was a bum bum. <laughs> Let's put them there. Let's get them in here so that we don't mix them up. 
Now it's good that they actually do uh, put the label on the bags themselves just in case you're one of these that separates and stores your paintings from your diamonds. Me, because it's coming in a beautiful sturdy box, it's going way back in that box until I'm ready to do them. So let's put this aside. And let's see if the ABs are in this one. Come on, come to mama. I know you're in here. You have to be in here. Oh, you have to be in here. All right. Okay, let's go. I can see one already. I can see one already. All right, all right, all right, all right okay. <laughs> let's just go. Oh, it's a green one. Look at it all too. Wow. And yeah, oh, a lemony yellow, like a pale yellow. And then the third one is a white. So there we are. Oh, oh, we get two of them. That's a lot of white. Wow, that's a lot of ABs for one painting. All of those. I'm impressed. Tick in the box. Wah, wah, wah. No, don't get don't get sick. But you know that 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 is a generous amount of ABs right there. Oh wow, holy dooly. Now, one thing I have to find out from those that are either affiliates, I'm not an affiliate with Dreamer Designs, not at all, but I, I'm sure that uh, one of my affiliate friends um, or even subscribers, if you know, the AB38, how do I know? Because, you know, sometimes it's about you guys teaching me a thing or three. Because if I don't know, there's sure to be others out there that don't know either. How do I know what that colour is equivalent to? Um, in the normal DMC world. Please share. Please let me know. All right. Oh, my gosh. And look at that deep red, 498. These are the rest of the colors here. The greens. Oh, wow. And three tens. We've got three bags of those. So that's not too bad. That's more three tens than what I had anticipated. But I guess there's a lot of outlining and things. So let's dive down into the canvas. Let me put these aside here. There. Let's dive down into the canvas and have a look closely at the drill field. So I'm thinking that there's most likely going to be symbols that I'm used to and symbols that will be new to me that I've not been uh, used to before. That B, what's that B? Oh, the B is, okay, alrighty, alright, I see what you're doing here. Where is it? Where's my finger? So this here, that, oh, ooh, ah, okay. I'm going to tell you all the things in a minute. But the symbols look pretty clear. Any blurriness that you're getting is more a case of this, um, this one here is a little bit iffy. What's that? The five? Is that just because my eyeballs are not working properly? Five and six, are they really that quite? Oh, they are. So these symbols here, where's my focus? Focus. These symbols here are very close together on the um, canvas itself. Very close in, in um, being able to distinguish. So there's the fives. I've lost where the sixes are, but they're very close. So I may need a light pad uh, with with the fives and the sixes because they are very similar in um, shading. I hate lifting the canvas up because it never focuses properly. There's the five. Um, see the six there? Where's my finger on the screen? Okay. So, oh, where's my finger gone? I've lost my own finger. Okay, so see there's the five, that's the six underneath. So you will be needing to concentrate on those. Okay, I know it's a bit of an in-depth analysis, but like I said, being that it's my first dream of designs, I really, really wanted to have a really close look. So let's have a look where these ABs go. So how do we know? Okay, so the, oh, I've packed them away. No, I didn't. Where are they? Yeah. All right, so starting from the start, 
47 okay so 47 is the white and the 47 here is the b so let's look for the symbol b let me see if i can turn my light on because it's getting up and hopefully is that it it's not providing you any disturbance which is good <clears throat> okay so b's are in here okay it's scattered wherever you see white basically so there's bees in here there's bees here white scattered in here um lifting it up there's none at the top there there's a lot of b there's a lot of um diamonds and yet Okay, so B's are in here. In this column here. Oh, okay. Down in here. Scattered in there, here, along here, here. So there's quite a lot um, in here as well. So you've got a generous amount of the white happening, okay? And as far as the canvas goes, you've got color line blocking here and you've got confetti here. You've got blocking in here. You've got color confetti here. Mixture of everything. So right up my alley, right there. Love that. All right, where does this yellow go now? So we've got this beautiful yellow. Now this yellow is number, how do I do this? 48 and we're looking for the letter T. So I'm looking, looking, looking peeps. Let's see where the letter T is being placed. T, T, T. Okay. So, oh, okay. So the T. Oh, I see. Okay. See this here? See this shade here? Let me see if I can focus for the people. How dare you? This yellow here. Okay. That's all that yellow AB. So it's all this T here. Uh, there's none in the flowers that I can see, so it's all, it's to highlight this entrata, this path. I'm guessing that, that there's, I can't see any other shades anywhere else. So that's where that yellow goes. And finally, the 49, which is this green, is the letter K. Now, if I'm not mistaken, yes, I'm not mistaken, every, it's all in here, where, wherever you see this shade here it's sprinkled sprinkled sprinkle 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 wherever you see that uh green so it's all sprinkled through here uh is there any up here none oh there's some here 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 anywhere that there's green literally up in the corner oh, that you can't see anymore up in there up in there <laughs> let me scoot you out again so you can see what i'm pointing to so that's where the green goes so what a generous amount of aurora borealis and just for those of you who don't know what i'm talking about when we're talking about ab's aurora borealis drills or ab's as we come to know them are diamonds that have got an extra special coating put over the top of them okay can you see how they've got that extra twinkle in them so what happens is, is when you put these little babies down on your canvas, not only are these gonna twinkle and sparkle on their own, but they're going to lift up the sparkle of their buddy diamonds next to them and make them twinkle and sparkle even more. So that's what an AB is. For those of you who have never heard of what I'm talking about and you're thinking, Gracie, please explain. <laughs> All right, shall we press on? Let me just make sure that I don't mix these diamonds up because they're gonna end up in a big pile. Let me put this one aside and let's go on to the next one. Shall we or shall we not? All right, let's rip into it, guys. Let's rip into it and see what the next one is. I haven't even, oh, and I didn't show you, I didn't show you because I wanted to keep it as a surprise, but on the end of your box, there is a picture of the, uh, painting okay what you can do with this is obviously leave it on there what until you're ready to diamond paint it however what you can also do is that when this box is finished with or when you're ready to diamond paint cut this out and if you go check out my videos on how to make your own uh, cover minder you can make your own personalized cover minder 
and then you can use that cover minder when you're doing your painting. See what I mean? See what I mean? I didn't do a measure on, on the uh, painting, did I? No, I didn't. I'm going to assume it to be the right size, but we'll do a measure on this one. I think because I'm just so excited about getting... This one's packed in real tight. I'm really understanding this tab business. Get out of here. Wow. This one's nice and heavy, so let's uh, let's have a look and see what's in this one. Again, I haven't even looked at the box, uh, the outside of the box to know what painting this is. There's are our diamonds. Here's our toolkit. Guys, rewind that way. Rewind. I'll give you a minute, okay? Rewind that way and go find where I talked about the kit because we're not going to do it all four paintings. We're just not. It's not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the same uh, bag to keep everything in. Pop that over there. And I don't... Yes, that's fine. All right, diamonds. We're going to collect these ribbons, I'm sure. Okay. Let's open this up. I might just, with this one... I'm not looking at it. Oh. Goodness gracious. I'm just trying to roll it back on itself, guys. Oi. Not behaving very well at all. And it is poured glue, okay? So we've got our sticker sheet there. We've got our instructions here. Yeet. Sorry, Dreamer Designs. No disrespect to what you've done, but we've already gone through it. And oh, we've got one of these again, remember? Smiley, sad, indifferent, out. <laughs> I'm going to have a, a collection of these. Maritza, I'll, I'll give you a run for your money, hey? We'll have a battle. <laughs> Which one will win? <laughs> We've got our, and I'll cover the, oh my gosh, this is really super long. 59 colours in this one. Okay, let's pop that aside over there. Is this one the right one? No, right way up. Yes, it is. Because I kind of botched it before and I wasn't happy. Was not happy. Don't worry about these little bumbles. They're nothing, okay? They will flatten out. They will flatten out. It's poured glue. She's going to be kind to you. All right. You ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Uno, due, e tre. Woo, baby! This one. La Porta Rosa sulla Salita. Okay, again, Guido Borelli. Have you got where I'm going with these paintings? So La Porta Rosa sulla Salita, okay, means the red door on the climb. So, again, it's kind of a bit of an anticlimax when they roll back on themselves. So the red door on the climb, yeah? This is your climb. This is your red door. This is again an Italian or European. I'm gonna go that it's Italian. I mean the artist Guido is Italian, okay? With a name like Guido Borelli, he got to be Italian. And the sticky is quite sticky. Okay, it's it's not too bad. It's not super super sticky. I'm gonna I'm not gonna lie. It's not um, you know wanting to rip my skin off, but it's not too bad either. It's not too bad either. What's that there? Ooh, is a thread. Is it a thread? Or is that the canvas that's been cut? I don't know. I'll have to see. Can you see that, guys? I think it's... I'm just going to get some tweezers. Um, is it a thread? Or is it the canvas that's been cut? I can't tell. Oh, no. It's... um. I think it's the glue, actually. I don't want to muck around with that too much, but um, I'll contact Dreamer Designs because I don't 
that's definitely not a thread that's no that's the glue that's the glue so interesting all right i will contact dreamer designs and let them know that that's happened and i guess we'll see what the customer service is and of course i will provide an update with that um I, now what did i get with this is this oh gosh it's another square it's another square <laughs> Uh, why do I do that to myself? I wonder if any of them are round. I can't remember. All right. So this one here, La Porta Su, uh, sorry, La Porta Rosa Sulla Salita. Okay, the red door under. Oh, sorry, the red door to the. Oh my gosh! Get your words. The red door on. Uh, oh my gosh! On the climb. Uh, this is thrown me this little thing here is thrown me so anyway don't worry about it let's just move on so we've got the pathway going up okay we've got the red door i'm hoping that this thing here is blinged out that's all i'm saying did i talk about the rest of the canvas before we've got their deets here their social media deets we've got our legends on both sides again nice and big at least that's consistent paint with passion guarantee okay here we go free dry Free Dreamer lifetime warranty. We have you covered to ensure lasting perfection. Enjoy Dreamer our, our insurance against accidents as well. Well, you know what? I'll be contacting them about that. So we'll see what they do. Um, what have we got here? We have uh, 59 colours. 59 colours, two of which are ABs. So only two ABs in this one and i don't know I, I have never worked with these symbols before so i don't know if their symbols for abs are the same from one canvas to another that's really bothering me anyway i wish this would lay flat okay let's have a look similar sort of color palettes okay so without opening them all up let me just see if I can find where the ABs are. I know that's really cheeky, isn't it? Um, I'm guessing it'll be in this packet here. I'm hoping. Um, maybe, maybe not. Maybe. Oh, I found you. I found it. I found it okay not quite as many in this one however we've got the same yellow that same creamy yellow and just a little bit of white so not as many at all in this one which what does that mean peeps what does that mean you know what it means it means i'm going to gracie gracie bling bling this up a little bit more i'm glad that it's got the same yellow because you know it's going to match nicely with the other painting that i got right let's put these babies back in here a second okay you can sit there a minute and let's have a quick squeezy and see where these are going to go so the white is uh just a dot in the middle so there's a bit of white here a bit of white up here not a lot of it so i'm not expecting you know i'll be pecking for it there's white here a white a b here Oh, and in here so very very sparse okay not a lot of it at all then we've got uh, this one here which is 59 which is the letter E and we've got it up here it's sprinkled up here it is sprinkled through there um, it's in here in here again it's highlighting this pathway up so it's all over here here along here i am surprised absolutely shockerooned shocked that given that it's la porta rosa the red door okay that there is no um no ids in the door i mean that would make sense to me that would make uh, you know that's the door I want to be highlighting. So there is no triple six in there, but I want to see what's this here. Ah, uh, nine, seven. 
I'm definitely going to uh, nine and seven. I'm definitely going to see what I can do to substitute some red ABs in here and might even do the archway as well in some gray ABs just to highlight this door. And then to match what I'm doing here and to make the, my eye, you know, go up, I might do the same, because that's the same gray as up here. So I might throw some grays, gray ABs up in there as well. Hmm. Interesting. I, I, I'm shocked that they didn't do that. I'm really, really shocked. They do have the white ones there, but I would have liked that red door to have been highlighted a little bit more. So, again, in keeping with my theme um, of, you know, that Italian rustic village, uh, just even though I've not been to Italy, this, this takes me there, if that makes sense. This really does take me there. I'm just trying to move it around so that you don't suffer with the glare. All right. Perfect. Grazie. Grazie, Guido. Grazie, Guido. Uh, this one, I'm not going to lie, a little bit disappointed about not having red ABs in the door during the designs, but, you know, that's just my personal preference and opinion. All right, so let me pop these over there so that I don't get them mixed up and let's just keep going. Let's just keep going because it's a marathon unboxing, don't you think? That one's empty, that one's empty. Oh, let's do this one. Let's just keep going. This box, now that's really strange. That's disappointing, I'm not gonna lie because this would have been put in my packing box like this, okay? my. The box that this, the, the big box that you saw it came undamaged, all right? That came undamaged. So for them to have packed my order like that, that's a little bit disappointing, you know? Let's just hope, let's just hope. That's all I'm gonna say is just let's hope that whatever's inside is not damaged. Because, you know, I'm already going to be writing to them about one. How many do I need to write to them about? Okay. Let's keep going. Which one is this one now? Okay, okay, okay. We've got our toolkit here. Pop that aside. Let's get this baby out. Ribbons, ribbons everywhere. Those of you that have got a gazillion Dreamer Design paintings. What do you do with all your ribbons? Do you like put them on the post of your bed and like, you know, they're like notches. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, another one. Happy, sad. No, we want to be happy. Maritza, I'm going to challenge you to a duel. You and me. <laughs> Every time I, I think of those foam rollers, I think of you. And if you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about Maritza from Kiss My Crafts. She's an amazing fellow YouTuber. We've got our instructions again um, from Kiss My Crafts. I'll try to remember to put her details in the description below. All right, come on now. I am going to, uh, let's try a different strategy with this one. Let's, um, what if we get this back and try and be smart and use that to guide. Okay, let me just put that under the crook of my arm. We've got our, our, our sticker sheet here again, crinkled a little bit there. Hopefully I can do, that won't be an issue. This one's got, wow. This one's got one, two, three, four ABs and 60 colors. Holy moly, holy moly. All right, let's uh, do that, did that. Hopefully that would have helped a little bit. We've got, now is this square or is it round? What did I do? Ah, round, yay! <laughs> I've got a round, yes! All right, let's see what this one is. Is it the right way up? No, it's not. Get it around the right way, peeps. All right, you ready? You ready, you ready, you ready, you ready? Uno, e due, e tre. Woo! Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Look at the colors in that. 
Oh my gosh! Le scale tra le case. Yeah? So le scale tra le case is the stairs between the houses. So these are the houses and you've got the stairs. So the stairs between the houses. Okay, I love that they've actually put, you know, um, I mean, that would be the name of the painting, but I love that, you know, it's in Italian. It just kind of warms my cotton little stuff. Did I tell you that there's actually a thumbnail? Probably not. Probably not. But I'm telling you now. So this one is around. And this one is a 90 by 60. 90 by 60, oh, 90 by 60, okay? Now, from memory, I think there is one or two others as well that are in this same color scheme. I think, I can't remember. I'm gonna have to go back and have a look. I chose for another thing, Dreamer Designs. If anyone should happen to be watching from Dreamer Designs, just some feedback. It would be awesome if it's not asking too much that you allow for more than four paintings to go in an order for shipping purposes. Just saying, just saying, you know, I understand, you know, that you're still being gracious enough to give us the free shipping and for that, I'm not complaining and I'm forever grateful, uh, but it would be really super awesome if we could put, you know, because like, you know, when I save my pennies up, you'd be sure that I'll be, I'll be ordering more than just the four, but look at those colors. Look at that detail. Oh, I'm loving these aquamarine kind of colors. We're gonna get into the diamonds in a second. I wonder if I open this and shut. What can I reach without pulling you? Uh, is that better? It's a little bit better. The lighting here is not the best today. It's overcast outside. But look at that. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this color. See, this color here, oh, where is it? Where's my finger? This color here, this aquamarine, when it's combined with that 814, you know, that maroon. Oh my gosh, my heart. Woo! I love it, I love it, I love it. So what have we got here? 60 colors. Now these are the rounds. Oh my God, is this gonna be the one that I start? Oh! <laughs> Two bags. Okay, uh, let's have a look. Uh, I'm gonna guess that the ABs are in here. And the round diamond, we'll, we'll open one packet up. I love this color. The color combination is just beautiful. Absolutely. <gasps> You're joking. You are absolutely joking me. How many ABs did I say? One, four, four, four. It says one, two, three. Come on, there's got to be some more in here. What am I missing? Sure, sharp. No way. No way, mate. So we've got two bags of the white. Okay, two bags of that white. Then we've got, what was I saying about this aquamarine sort of colour? Look, and we got a bag of ABs for it. And a little itty bitty bag of the red, not a lot at all. And then, a, oh my gosh, that is just so pretty. That is so pretty, this one. I've got to find out what colour that is. It's not a baby pink, it's, it's just focus so that people can see, Gracie. That is just so pretty. Uh, uh, the camera's not doing it justice whatsoever. Oh, wow. All right, so let's see where these babies go. So, what's that? Is that 57? 57 is the white, and the white is a circle. So, white, white, and sprinkled all throughout the building in lines. Okay, so all up in the building, all up in this building. This building's going to sparkle. Sparkle, I tell you, sparkle and twinkle. It's all in here. White, 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 white ABs all over there. Oh my gosh, beautiful. Absolutely stunning, exquisite. Now guys, if you think that I'm gonna be able to peck and hunt where these go, wow, 58 is, it's 
kind of like a hammer. Okay. Oh gosh. Okay, so there's a few up here. There's a few up here. Now that I know what color. Oh, and in the roof here is this color here. Okay, this color here. So it's up in here, 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 here. Um, I'm looking everywhere else. I think that's pretty much it. I think it's just predominantly up here, highlighting this rooftop. Okay, so this one here, oh my, I can't even. That is just exquisite. 59 is the number two. Please tell me it's in here. Yeah, so it's scattered all throughout this tree here. Oh my gosh. OMG. Actually, hang on, is it? Two, 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 yeah, two. I'm looking to see if it's in the doors and it's not. I like the fact that Dreamer Designs has got a, a mixture of red, white and black symbols in the sense of, you know, like the actual... Number two, it's in a red color on, on a green background, so it's very distinguishable. Come on, there's got to be more than... Yeah, it's scattered all in here, that two. Yeah, all in here. Um, is there any down here? No. So it's predominantly up in that tree. So that's what... So we've got that blinged up. We've got a bit of pink AB across here and then we've got the white in this building here. Honestly, guys, you really don't need too much more than that. Uh, I, just, with Aurora Borealis, in my personal humble opinion, get, look, at, look at that. That's going to be a lot of bling, right? Sometimes less is more or you've got to be very strategic in where you place it because otherwise, it, to me personally, it just dilutes it. And it takes away from the effect rather than enhancing it. But I love this. Look, you've got the stairs here. Okay. Um, you know, you've got your pot plants, your terracotta um, pot plants here, here. Very, very symbolic. The shadowing on the stairs here is just phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. And you can see the shadow here. Guido, oh my gosh, what a talented, talented artist talented artist you can tell that this here you know is three-dimensional you know you, you you'll be able to see once it's diamond painted properly you can see how he's painted it and you can visualize it being three-dimensional as you walk through oh my goodness what a stunning painting stunning stunning painting and I didn't do any of the measures on the others okay however let's just do one just so that we we do all the things okay so it's a 60 by 90 i like 60 by 90 because this will go what's wrong with what's wrong with you buddy what's wrong with you i think he's, i was going to say he, he's a bit constipated <laughs> no he twisted up the poor darling okay <laughs> so it is spot on oh it's actually well, if I was to flatten it out properly, it's just shy of 90. It's one centimetre shy of 90 that way. And here, it is just shy of one centimetre that way. So it's actually 59 by 89, okay? Again, for me, this goes perfectly into your poster size 60 by 90 frames, which are cheap as chips, cheap as chips. So that is the third of our fourth. Le Scale Tra Le Case by Guido Borellis, 90 by 60, three ABs round. Oh my gosh. See, I like, I like the generous amount of ABs, the placement of ABs in this one. They did a good job on this one. I'm happy with this one. Now, obviously, I won't be able to give final thoughts until I've actually finished one, okay? Um, or started working on one and give you a progress report on how I'm feeling about it 
all that good stuff. But um, you saw a rough um, indication of the colours in that. Let's pop that in there so that we don't get them all mixed up. The last thing you want to do is get your diamonds mixed up uh, all over the place. Okay, so let's pop that aside over there. And of course, I flicked it over here. And I can't remember if I showed you. Oh, yes, I did because this had a bit of a crinkle in it. Now, the box was damaged. Thankfully, this canvas came through okay. It was a bit crinkly at the end here. I'm not fussed about that whatsoever. Okay, but thankfully, this one came through okay. There's a bit of thread here. Just take that out. But other than that, sticky. Is that? Oh, are they all like that? I wonder. So this one here, I didn't know. I'm going to have to check the others now. Is that a Dreamer Designs thing or is that... I don't know. So there's like a border all the way around. Again, very similar to diamond dots in that respect. Is that sticky though? I hope not. It is. Interesting. Interesting. So there is a border around it. And it is sticky but it's not diamond painted there's no there's no symbols for you to diamond paint if that makes sense okay because you know typically if it if that wasn't sticky that would be a lovely border just to leave on the end for framing purposes you know what I mean but now because it's um actually a little bit sticky and I've just looked behind me, they all have that border. And it's all sticky. So that's an interesting, interesting new to me thing. Uh, when I say new to me, like I said, I've seen it on other companies, but I just picked that up on the Dreamer Designs one. So, Le Tre, Le Scale Tre, oh my gosh, Le Scale Tra Le Case by Guido Borelli. Again, has got that very vintagey sort of very villagey sort of um, feel to it. Oh my gosh, my heart, my heart, my heart. Oh. Okay, last and certainly not least, let's get into the last one. I hope you've been keeping up guys oh. because you know, it's a really, really exciting um, unboxing for me given that it is my first dreamer designs so I want to work one up or at least start working on one before I place any more orders with them there are others that I do want to order so but that being said there's those tags again okay flick flick uh, I do want to see what these are going to be like before I uh, place any more. Okay. Da, da, da. Toolkit. Canvas. And diamonds. Canvas bag again. Toolkit again. And let's undo this. It's like real, um, oh, they're really tight. <laughs> yep. Okay. Pop that aside again. Let's, uh, I wonder if they would flatten out quicker if they weren't around the roll. Look, I kudos to them that they're taking uh, all those precautions in in trying to make sure that they do come safely, you know, wrapping it around the roll, then putting it inside the box and all of that. So uh, diamond painting, if, you have, if you've not been around YouTube diamond painting too much, if you haven't picked up on it already, and I say it all the time, it is definitely 
um, a product that you will get what you pay for, okay? Now, it's not only the diamond painting themselves, diamond paintings themselves that I take into account when dealing with a company. It is actually also the customer service and everything that goes with it. So, is this the right way? Yes, it is. What's this one now? Let me cover the... Let me cover, cover, cover. 60 colours. And in this one we have one, two, three, four, five ABs. Are you joking me? Five. Count them with me. One, two, three, four, five. Holy moly. And it's around, it's around. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, guys. I like my squares, but wow, I'm glad that in the end these ended up being two round and two squares. All right, let's see what the last one is. I did say it was round the right way, did I not? Yes, I did. Let's waste no more time. Uno, due, e tre. And woo! La traporta rosa al tramonto. Okay, what does that mean? La traporta rosa al tramonto is the other red door at sunset. The other red door at sunset. Again, Guido Borelli, 90 by 60. Okay, it doesn't really look like sunset. One would, well, not from what it looks like on here. It doesn't really sort of give you that feeling of sunset. You would expect maybe some more oranges and yellows maybe. But that's what he's named it. I love, I love, I love this big legend. You know, this, your girl here hasn't got good eyes. So that, uh, that I just love. And I am dying to see what ABs are in this one. So again, we've got the same theme. We've got the stairs, okay? L'altra porta, the other door. The other red door. Do you see how I did that? Yeah, if you kept up with it. You know me, guys. You should know me by now. I do everything in sets. I have to. It's uh, very rarely very rarely, especially when I find paintings that speak to me on a level such as like, you know, what these ones here mean to me. I'm not even going to, oh, I'm just butchering this even worse. Oh, yo, yo, Gracie, Gracie. You're not doing a good job. Hmm. Come on. Do it for the peeps. Oh, just, just, just. We'll just leave it like that. <laughs> wow. I love that's def definition. So you've got a stairway this way. You've got a stairway this way. You've got your terra terracotta pots. You've got that burnt terracotta archway. The red door. Okay. This must be Kumari Maria's house on the other side. <laughs> Oh, such stories that my grandmother tells me of such things. And you've got all your greenery and you've got this building here in the distance. More greenery and then, of course, a little bit of sky. Not a lot. You haven't got a lot of sky in this at all. So you can get that 3D feel. Let's have a look. OMG. I'm going to guess it's in this one. A nice, uh, a nice um, variation of colours on this one. You've got pinks, you've got reds, you've got greens. Like, honestly, guys, you've, not a lot of each, but look, you've got variation. A, a lot of more muted colours, which you know, if you've been around long enough, that I don't mind at all. So let's see what spoils we have in here for ABs. All right, so we have, again, the white. Gosh, the ABs on this are like, seriously, so shimmery, so shiny. So, I'm gonna focus for the people. Nope, no, it's just not gonna behave. Just take my word for it. I would tell you, you, you need to kind of like, really trust me that I would tell you if I wasn't happy. Actually, this one here, this one here has a bit of static in it. Nothing that, you know, grenading that with a dry sheet won't help, but um, that's, 
Is it just that one? Yeah, the two, these two here are a bit staticky. I'm just going to do a quick look at the rest of them. No, I, I, but the ABs definitely, they're jumping around in there, so I'll have to do something with them before I crack them open. And I think these are our other ABs here. Oh my word. Oh my word. These are all our other ABs. Oh, wow. Look at that green again. Look at that blue. Oh, let's have a look. We're going to have to hunt and peck, I'm sure, which we're not going to spend too much time because I don't want you to get bored. I hope you don't get bored. Um... All right, so the white here is, see how that, the symbols differ from canvas to canvas. The white here is a circle with a circle, a shekel with a circle. And that is line blocking here. All these paintings, just if I haven't covered it already, have combinations of color blocking and confetti. Totally my jam, totally what I like. So I'll be happy with that. So this is all uh, white ABs here, white ABs here through there um there's got to be more than that oh here we go i was gonna say there's got to be more than that they give us two whopping bags this all the white here that's all white ab's wow how blingy is that gonna be white ab there all that so all in here here white 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 did i say up there did i say up here white so that's those ones then 57 is the aquamarine one here and that is that two lines that go this way so once i find it the first time i'll know what i'm looking for so that's oh come back here that's in here 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 okay so it's the aquamarine so can you see that where can you see tell me if you can it's this color here so it's here 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 Yep, here, all this here, all the aquamarine that you see down in this trellis of flowers down here, as you know, the flowers are coming down. Here, all here, here, wow. A little bit over here, some up the top, some down here, some down here. That, that's a generous amount of this green. It's beautiful, beautiful. And then we've got this lilac or lavender here. And we're looking for, what number is that? 58? 58. 58 is a Q. Yeah, good luck, Gracie, trying to find the Q. Hey, All right, so we've got some down here. It's this little one. Oh, oof, oof. It's this little one down here. Okay, so there's a little bit down here. Here. It's going to be sprinkled. And it's like, where's Wally with the Q? Because there's not going to be, you can see that you don't get a lot, so... It's through there. And if I'm looking for that colour. Oy vey. Yeah. Good luck, Gracie, looking for that colour. They're not going to give me that many. Is that it? No, that's D. Did I just bump you guys? I'm so sorry if I did. I have to bring it up to me because I'm a struggling guys. I'm a struggling to, oh, okay. So there's more here. Oh, it's through here. Okay. All right. So it's through these flowers here. There. I'm looking to see if there's any up in those flowers up the top. And I can't seem to see any. But I'm sure there will be more. Oh, if not, that's okay. So 59 is a K, which is <clears throat> red. Now I'm wondering if they decided to do this red door. This is where you hear the crickets, isn't it? I'm just looking wherever they've got red to make sure. All I've got to do is find one and then I'll know what symbol, I'm, well not what symbol, but what. Mm. 
Wow. I'm a struggling to find where the red AB goes. You would think, oh, here. Okay. Oh, mamma mia. So they've gone. So even though it's La Traporta Rosa, in other words, the other red dot, they've decided to put the red in the bushes over here. I don't know. I don't know. What are you thinking about? Why not you put some of the red ABs over here, mate? I don't understand. I no understand. Oh yeah, there's some red ABs and there's some red ABs through here. I'm going to have to do something again here with this red door, even if it's just the archway. Even if it is just the archway, I'm going to have to do something there. And then we've got the blue. Okay, so 60 is the double less than sign. And as I suspected, it's in the sky. So all the blue here, all this blue in the sky is this blue here. Look how bright, look at that. That's going to be one bright sky. Wow. Wow. And all up here. All A, B. Wowzers, wowzers, wowzers. Oh, I'm liking that. Oh, and there's a bit of static. So this particular bunch here has got a bit of static and I can see that. So that, you know what? Wow. Two round, two squares. I'm okay with that. It actually gives me a good opportunity to test both with the company, as I said. And please, Dreamer Designs, I beg of you, for as long as you can hold out, Please continue to offer this free shipping to Australia uh, because, you know, uh, I would appreciate it. <laughs> I would appreciate it. So let's go through them all again. This one here. Let me put here what this uh, painting will look like or is like on the website for you so that you can tell. I forgot to do that as I went along, but I'll do that now for you guys. So that's the first one. Okay. And it's friend, which is a different size, slightly different color schemes. Is La Porta Sulla, sorry, La Porta Rosa Sulla Salita. So they are different colors. Okay. Which is okay. And it's a different size. This is an 80 by 60. That one is a 90 by 60. So that's the second one. You can see that the, the detail does come up better. In, it, it ever so slightly larger, okay? All legally licensed by Guido Borelli. I think of all of them, I think this one's my favorite. I think this one, I think, I think, I think is my favorite. Le scale tra le case. I think this one here is my fave. But we'll see. I won't know until I get them all done. And then finally, last but not least, where we started, which is this one here. Entrata al borgo. Okay. So 80 by 60, two 80 by 60s. Uh, which are these two here. Interesting that the two smaller ones are squares. Okay, that's an interesting observation, I think. Is that? Yeah. So even though this is smaller because it's square, it will give the detail, hopefully, the same, to the same effect as the larger sizes that are round. And that's, that's the advantage that you get with doing squares, is they do give you that extra detail or extra definition and le less pixelation, if you would. So they're my Italian themed Dreamer Designs paintings. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so excited. Look at that. I, I feel like I just want to jump on a plane and go to <laughs> go. I was going to say go to heaven. Oh, there's a, there's a, mm, no, I want to go to Italy right now, right now. Uh, thank you so much if you've gotten this far in my presentation and my first thoughts of Dream and Design Canvases. It's this one here. This one here, I think is calling me. This one here, right here. 
Uh, thank you so much if you've gotten this far in my first, first impressions of Dreamer Designs. Wherever you are in your part of the world, I truly, 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 truly am sending you all much, much love. Okay, I hope that you're looking after yourselves. I hope that you're looking after each other. Okay, until my next video, have a wonderful rest of your day, a fantastic rest of your week. And until next time, <gasps> ciao, ciao for now.